welcome back and thank you for joining us today. But today is super, super exciting because it is Cloudy's first ever outing arena hire. Um, it's gonna be mine as well on him. Um, but I'm super, super excited. All the horses and ponies are just coming off the lorry right now. Cloudy's all the way at the back, so you can just about see him. We've come here because we're trying to get Cloudy used to going out and him practicing lots of different things and seeing with the jumping. But Cloudy is being a bit of a fidget pants at the moment. He's trying to escape. Cloudy. Hi. Steady. Rumby, I think you might need a bit of help with this and this one. Oh, I'm coming off. Don't want to get run over. So Cloudy's always spicy when he goes anywhere. So we're just walking him round, um, making sure he knows his surroundings and he's nice and calm. Yeah, chill and calm. No, chill and calm please, Cloudy. I don't know whether I'm looking forward to this or not because I know I'm going to fall off already. What have you been doing in that horse box, Cloudy? Getting You're dr dripping in sweat. Look at all the other Shetlands. Not a. This is so good for him. After. Not any sweat on them, and you're like, it looks like you've just had a sweat bath. This looks really good. Yeah. every single jump in the arena. So that's what I've done. Um, I'm starting to forget which ones I've done, but that's fine. Um, I've done about six on this rain, so I'm gonna do some more on the other rain. done a bit of warming up and now I think we're going to do some jumping. We've not done that much jumping with Cloudy. We've only ever jumped at home. He's done two races and one was jumping and he only managed to get over one in the jumping. Um, but it wasn't really it wasn't really his fault because he got bumped. So the main aim today is for that we get over as many jumps as we can here without any refusals hopefully or the like barely any refusals so because it races you don't get any second chances they have to go over the jumps first time so yeah but that is what today is all about it is getting over the jumps for the first time um, and loads of determination and positive riding. But I'm just gonna wait for V to tell me what jump I'm gonna do first. I reckon we're gonna do one of the smaller ones first just to get started with. Um, but the only problem is, is there's so many jumps and if you're in like a fast canter going up to one jump, then there's a bigger jump behind it, like about 20 meters behind it and you can't really steer then. 
I want to get around every single one of these jumps on the first attempt. And I think, I think we can do it. He's had a look at all the jumps. Um, and yeah, it's all looking pretty good. We had a few refusals today, but it was such an amazing progress. Um, he got over the water jump. He did the green roll top. He got over everything I asked him to. Some it wasn't first time. Um, we've still got a long way to go, but this is just part of the training. He loved his jumping so much. He did give us a bit of mischief, um, but... Oh, hi, hi, little ponies. He gave us a bit of mischief, but... He got over it in the end and he was just like, oh, I just want to have some fun. Let's do all the jumps. Um, and yeah, we did manage to get over all the jumps that we wanted him to. There was just one, which was a brick wall. It wasn't made out of brick. It was like, I would, um, but it was just a bit too tall for them. And you couldn't you didn't like, try that one, did you? No, we didn't try that one because it was too big for the Shetlands. You jumped everything in there, didn't you? Yep. And we're just going to try and get him out as much as we can yeah now just to be doing any kind of jumping so show jumping arena hires what i want to do is i want to do like a little show jumping thing on him yeah definitely. A little competition like the smallest that they do we're just going to be doing as much as we can with him this summer he actually does love his jumping but i think he just lacks a little bit of confidence but once he's gone over it a few times like he jumps it insane but it's just that confidence that he just needs to go in first time and just nail it, but he's getting there. We used our brand new white saddle pad and it's gone a bit grim. It looks like it's been coated in, like when you, when mum wears like a white blouse or like if you wear a white blouse and you have makeup on, it looks like there's, cause his, his hair, it's bit kind of makeup, his hair it? looks like contour. It's like a <laughs> contour color. I think he's tired now. Don't you Harley? Oh my. Goodness, he's a tired boy. Uh, Stay on his good side. Trade. <laughs> good boy, yeah, is that good? Is that good? We've got a tractor merch. Tractor merch. He likes his head. Oh, you spread it out again. I don't know why, but I just feel like this is so his personality. A tractor. The tractor. <laughs> I wonder if he's just going to like bend his knees and roll, Harlow. Yeah, he probably will, knowing, knowing him. With no warning. Don't Make sure he not... doesn't roll on the hat, he likes rolling on stuff. Oh yeah, just go and roll on my nice skull cap. <laughs> I think he's, he's not going to roll on that rug, is he? Oh no, just looking for grass. His rug's a bit wonky. Tony! Gonna give him a little holo and then put him up the ramp, darling. Ready? Let's 
put them up the ramp. Good boy. I'm gonna try it up. doing some more Shetland training with Cloudy. Um, it's a bit chilly but um, that's gonna that's gonna go straight out the window in a minute. Um, but yeah there's there's loads of new well they're not new there's loads of jumps in this field now um, and Cloudy had a go in here yesterday jumping them and he was super super good um, but now we're gonna jump them again today. He's got a race coming up in about 10 days time, so we're getting in all the practice that we can. But yeah, let's start warming up and go over these jumps. Uh, come and get it if you feel nice. Uh, are you ready to come alive? We're back to it. working on the home turn because sometimes we're going a bit too fast to get it so we're just working on controlling over that um, but yeah so the home turn if you don't know what it is it's basically when you come over the last jump which is that one you have to come round and do your last corner and then at the center so basically where a or c is um, so so say a where a is you've got a sharp turn down and come past that like small cone there. So yeah, it's down the center line for the finish and you've got to pass that cone and that will decide who wins. Ready? Yep. Ah, wake up, I know I'm ready. Steady, steady, get up steady, steady, and hold steady. steady. I'm gonna Ooh. do what I do and get it done now. I got no doubt about it. I'm gonna go and get it. Reach up and climb to the top. And I'm on my way now, and I'm making waves now, ready or not, here I go! Good boy. He was kind of like aiming for the hedge over there. He's just quite unbalanced coming down the hill and doing that jump there. But yeah, he's still, that was amazing. Yeah. Good boy. Other arenas will be like completely straight. Um, but I mean, the wonkier the better to practice in. Yep. I'm ready to go.
got a feeling that is so divine Oh, I got something that you can't define I gotta show you So come on, tell me what you heard What you heard Got the green light No more red light Got the green light Are you ready for this? Got the green light There's no red light Got the green light Come ready to go mishaps on that round but <sighs> so the problem with cloudy is as he's still a bit green and a bit unbalanced um he finds it hard to go down like hill like hills going fast and turning after them so what we're trying to do is um put the jump out a bit wider so then we don't have to turn as quickly after the jump we'll make it more like Rather than an egg shape, more of like a fat, puffy egg. I don't know if this is just gonna like make it worse or will it make it easier for me to like slow him down? You've got more time. So yeah, but I don't know, it's more of like a hill. It is more of a hill, but you've got, you've got more time from there to there to rebalance him. Yeah. So that's, you, but I literally like, as soon as you've landed from that one, bring him straight back. Did we have this problem with the training day? I don't think we did. Very flat at the training day. Oh, yeah. Sense. You'll only have problems like this in specific rings. Yes. We got a beautiful story. Okay, I think you might need a bit of a bubble bath. It's a bit sweaty and all that sweat from yesterday. Yeah, you look so different. Cloudy's been such a good boy. It was so much better from, from yesterday. We haven't had as many problems as yesterday. We've been actually able to get on with some stuff. We got a beautiful story. So as it's the summer holidays in literally 10 days time, we want to have a goal for Harlan and Cloudy that Harlan would be able to, to canter confidently on Cloudy by the end of the summer holidays. Um, it's going to take some work, but yeah, I think we could do it. And all the hard work that I've been doing um, to make Cloudy less green and more confident um, is going to pay off for Harlan because it'll be a lot easier for Harlan to ride. Oh, this is going to be so sweaty and gross. 
He's like, I'm so tired. Heat wave, too much for Shetlands. <laughs> too much main, too hot. <laughs> if, I know you want this off, but I need to undo the, all the buckles for you to get it off, okay? We've got these like fluffy things um, that we use for when we're doing like racing um, or like race or like jump, jump racing at home. Um, they're basically like a bit like blinkers. Um, but yeah, they're a bit fluffy um, and they're like an all round size. So they're a bit big for Cloudy. Um, but yeah, he looks very cute from front on, don't you? I need your head, I need to put your head collar on. Ooh, cloudy, come here. Come here. Oh, he's so sweaty. He's even got sweaty eyebrows. Don't know if they exist on horses, but apparently mum said he's got sweaty eyebrows. So, where? Above his eye. Well, there? Yeah. That is, that's not an eyebrow, that's an eyelid crease. Oh, no, not that far. I just needed to come here to turn the hose on. Okay, we can do a loop, but you're gonna need to have a hose off because it's all sweaty. Good boy. Oh, nice. He's not that impressed, but I'm very jealous right now, Cloudy. Get to have a nice hose off. And I don't, and I'm like as sweaty as you. I wish we had the video when we s tried to hose Cloudy for the first time because it was absolute carnage. Cloudy was like, ah, why is there a snake spitting out water? He was absolutely hating it. He wanted to be anywhere else in the world, but with the hose. But now he's like, he drinks from the hose actually. Go drink now. He was rearing up before and he like absolutely hated it. And now he's drinking from it, yeah? Do another drink? Do another drink? So we've actually got a sweat scraper for the ponies now. Our other ones are both broken. One's Harlan and one's just old use. Um, Harlan was seeing how far it could bend. Um, but yeah, that's a different story for a different day. And in here, the farm has had kittens, but we've got to make sure the dogs aren't around. Just so we're on the safe side. This one's really feisty and she goes like, ah. When I see her open her mouth, should we get Tilly? No, she doesn't do anything. She, she's just a very sassy, sassy, sassy kitten. Good girl. <laughs> so this one. Favourite ones. Yes. This one doesn't hiss. Nice. I think you were a boy, aren't you? Do you like the mic? He <laughs> likes the mic. Yes. This is its face. Oh yeah, if you hear Cloudy winning, it's because he's sniffing Tippy. Little fact, I am actually allergic to cats, but these ones are just so cute to resist. Yes. Yes. Can we get down now? Do you want to see? I'll show you the feisty one. She's not actually feisty, she just doesn't like really... Wait, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah, look, she's absolutely fine to handle, aren't you? Yeah. Oh, and there's one up in the roof. I'm going to go put Cloudy to bed now, but thank you all so much for watching today's vlog, and I'll see you soon. Bye. Can I say bye? Hello, Paul. Bye.
Right, I'm going to put you down now. I'm going to go put Cloudy to bed.